a few months ago, this guy, his name is Mike Huckabee, was quoted as saying that the Obamas should be careful allowing their daughters to listen to Beyonce because, you know, she corrupts people. Are you kidding me? A few weeks ago, a disc jockey was quoted as saying that Iggy Azalea, she's the Australian female rap artist, is destroying the rap genre. What? Why is it that these two successful female musicians are being hated on by men? I mean, if Beyonce is corrupting our young girls, can we say that Eminem is corrupting our young men? And if Iggy Azalea is destroying the rap genre, can we say that any guy who tries to take on pop music is destroying the pop industry? I mean, because typically, you know, girls are the bubblegum pop princesses, right? So why is there this double standard? Why can't Beyonce be the queen and who is empowering young women to love themselves and their bodies and be comfortable with the idea of sex? And why is it that she's corrupting young girls, but Eminem's not corrupting young men? And why is it that Iggy Azalea is destroying the rap genre when she's actually, according to iTunes, the number one international female best-selling artist, if you can follow that train of thought, of this year in rap, but someone like, I don't know, Justin Bieber or Nick Jonas isn't destroying the pop industry. Is it just because they tend to have more fans, whereas Iggy Azalea is maybe lacking in fans? It's just, it's just a question I have. Maybe someone else can answer that for me. 